Hello, welcome to plsql02pro.com. This is Hassan Mir. In this tutorial, we're going to talk about if then else if conditional control. Okay. So, in the previous tutorials, we have seen if then statement, which is pretty simple. If and then you put a condition. If this condition is true, all these statements are executed. Otherwise, not, nothing, no, no statement is executed. Okay. So, this is a simple if then uh, clause here. Then you learn about if else condition. So, it some goes like this. If some condition if this condition is true then statement 1 2 would be executed and if this condition is not true then statement 3 and 4 would be executed okay now you are going to see another variation this this is if else if clause here so it works it goes like this if some condition if this condition is true then all these statement 1 2 etc would be executed otherwise this condition 2 would be evaluated if the condition 2 is true, then statement 3, 4, etc. would be executed. Otherwise, if, statement, if condition 2 is not true as well, then 5, 6 would be executed anyway. Okay? So either 1 or 2 would be executed, or 3 or 4 would be executed, or 5 or 6 would be executed. Okay? So if condition 1 is true, then statement 1 and 2 would be executed. If condition 2 is true, then 3 and 4 would be executed. Otherwise, statement 5 and 6 would be executed okay Ag again else if and else clauses are optional okay the only mandatory clause is if clause in the if statement so this is a uh, flow chart of if then else if uh, conditional control so it works like this if uh, states the starting of the if clause here condition 1 if condition 1 is true then all these statements would be executed if condition 1 is not true is false then condition 2 would be evaluated only if the condition 1 is not true otherwise condition 2 is not evaluated if condition 2 is true then all these statements would be executed otherwise all these statements will be executed okay and uh, so let's do some examples practical example of uh, if then else if control so let's say uh, we have the same situation we are capturing a score and based on whatever score has been achieved we are uh, dis uh, displaying remarks on the screen okay so let's uh, write a quick PLSQL program so this is the skeleton of the program and we are capturing a score in a variable score of type number and we are initializing this variable by getting the input from the screen and, and this bind variable from the from the user okay now we're gonna write if else if else if and else clause here so this is a skeleton of the whole uh, if else if control okay so again this else so wow what a typo okay else if does not have e here okay don't write e l s e i f only it's e l s i f okay so just keep that in mind okay so what is a condition one condition one is if we score let's say we're gonna give three remarks poor good and excellent or let's say poor average and good okay so that's three remarks we're gonna give so if we score is less than uh, let's say 50 then it's a poor score okay so then uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna say dbms output put line uh, poor score oh. okay so now else if then we want Oracle to check like if the score is less than 50 then fine the score is poor that's what we display on the screen but if score is not less than 50 then Oracle is gonna check is it less than 70 then if it's less than 70 uh, by the time Oracle come here it's already established the score is not less than 50 okay so then we are gonna be displaying on the screen uh, average score otherwise if it's not less than 50 and if it's not less than 70 then it has to be 70 or more if it's 70 or more then we can display on the screen excellent or good score okay so that's all this program is gonna do it's gonna check the score and based on the score it's gonna put the remark so this is a perfect example of if else if and else clause here okay so let me try to run this uh, program a window should pop up asking me to enter score let's say I enter score 30 and I click on submit button here so now 
Oracle is going to give me the remark based on 30. Poor score. Okay. So let me run this program again. And uh, so this time I'm going to enter score is 60. Submit. So I should get the remark accordingly. Average score. You can see here. Now I'm going to run this program again. And this time I'm going to enter very good score. something wrong I just click on run button here okay Oracle is taking time to popping up that window so let's say my score is 90 this time submit button so it's that window okay so Oracle give me the remark good score okay so that's pretty much it few things here uh, else clauses or as I said else if and else clauses are optional okay so now if I remove this clause else clause now if the score is not less than 50 and if it's not less than 70 70 or more then I'm not gonna uh, get anything on the screen okay so I just run this program again the window popping up asking me to enter score let's say I enter 90 I run this program and I would not get any output because there is no else now anymore okay I, I will only get the result if I enter something less than 70 okay so let's say 65 uh, now I should get the remark because I just removed the else clause okay now another thing is let me put the else back quickly I want to show you something else uh, just food for thought else and was else good good score okay so let's say if I ask you to write the same program uh, let's say if I remove this less than key from your keyboard and I ask you to write the same program without this less than key how would you write it okay so that's the thing you only have a greater than key now you can do the same thing by by saying by first checking if the score is greater than equal to let's say 70 then you can say it's a good score see if you have to write the same program same means same logic then you have to go greater than or equal to you can't say just greater than because that will not include 70 70 in the last program we wrote 70 was a good score as well so you have to be uh, you know you have to write exactly inverse of the program so if score is greater than 70 then it's good score if it's not greater than 70 70 or greater than 70 then you have to check if it's greater than equal to 50 or not okay so if it's 50 or more then again it's an average score otherwise it's a poor score okay so it's the same program written without the less than key on your keyboard so just run a very one test run and we're gonna get uh, right like uh, 65 is a good score run this program I should get the same result okay average score uh, just one more time run and uh, again it's Oracle thing time so let's say I enter 90 I should get excellent score good score good score okay same program same logic all we did is reverse the logic here okay or reverse the the way we are processing the, the condition so anyway that has nothing to do with the program that has to do with the algorithm in your mind so first you have to design the algorithm whenever you're pro solving any problem only then you can write the program okay so anyway so that's pretty much it I see you in the next tutorial